In this tutorial, we're going to look at how we can apply the green screen effect to video. First of all, go to Blackboard, click Video Editing, then click Files and Resources to Download. Look here under Lesson 2, and what I want you to do is download any one of these green screen footage examples. Then open up Premiere Pro, create a new project, and up here call it Green Screen. Then click OK. From last week, you'll recall that we need to have down here Project Green Screen tab clicked. Bring up Windows Explorer, go to wherever you saved your video, and click and drag that green screen option into your project. Now we want another video here as well. The same would apply with a picture actually. But if I go to that wildlife video and use the one from last week as well. Then I can close Windows Explorer. Now first of all, click and drag the wildlife video into your timeline. Notice it goes onto the V1, Video 1 layer. If I now just scroll up here and click and drag the green screen layer, but this time I need it to be on the V2, or Video 2 layer. It's really important that this is above what we want to uh, replace with the green, which is the wildlife one below. If I click the green screen layer and then double click here in the preview panel, you can see if needed we can resize this video footage here. Now to apply the green screen effect itself, what you need to do is go over here to the effects tab, open up video effects, scroll about halfway down to keying, open that folder up, and scroll right down to the bottom of that, and you're looking for this one that says ultra key. From the icon here, click and drag ultra key over to your timeline timeline and let go over your green screen layer. Then up here you should have the effects control tab selected. If it's not selected it's probably still the source by default so click effect controls. If you've got nothing here just make sure you click the green screen layer once. Now what we need to do is do something with this key colour. This needs to be the same as the green in our green screen footage. So I click on the eyedropper tool here, go over to the preview panel and click once anywhere on that green. Now if I just move my playhead into the video a bit, you can see what was green is now the video footage from the wildlife video on the video one layer. Now to get this perfect, what I need to do is just a mixture of moving the top layer, resizing the bottom layer, moving it around until I'm happy with the results. Then you can preview your uh, video by pressing the play button. And you can see the true effects of the green screen. Thank you.